histological analysis of short-term vital reactions in skin wounds involves studying the cellular and tissue changes that occur in the immediate aftermath of injury. These reactions typically include inflammatory responses, cellular migration, and tissue repair processes. Histology, or the microscopic examination of tissues, allows for the detailed observation of these changes. Some key aspects of histological analysis of short-term vital reactions in skin wounds include inflammatory response. This involves the recruitment of immune cells such as neutrophils and macrophages, dilation of blood vessels, and release of inflammatory mediators to clear debris and pathogens from the wound site. Cellular migration, various cells, including fibroblasts and endothelial cells, migrate to the wound area to initiate tissue repair and angiogenesis formation of new blood vessels. Tissue repair. This involves the deposition of extracellular matrix components, like collagen and elastin, which contribute to scar formation and wound closure. Applications in forensic work. Understanding the histological changes in short-term vital reactions in skin wounds can have several applications in forensic investigations, estimation of time since injury. Histological analysis can help estimate the age of a wound by examining the stage of wound healing. This information is crucial in determining the timing of an injury in forensic investigations. Within six hours, acute inflammation is still working in the skin. Whether the person is alive or passed away, Kayapagna interpayam skinang is an decedent. One can't distinguish under the microscope if antemortem or post-mortem. History na long and magsasabi how the body of the decedent was handled. John Papasakang is a forensic pathologist to decide in the conclusion and personal opinion. Differentiating antemortem and post-mortem wounds. Examining cellular responses and changes can aid in differentiating wounds. Sustained before death antemortem from those occurring after death post-mortem. Identifying cause of death, histological analysis can assist in determining whether a wound was fatal or contributed to the cause of death. Fibrin in acute inflammation. Fibrin is a protein involved in blood clotting and wound healing. During acute inflammation, fibrinogen as soluble plasma protein is converted into fibrin strands forming a meshwork that helps to staunch bleeding at the site of injury. Fibrin also serves as a scaffold for cells involved in the healing process, aiding in tissue repair. Future in skin wound forensics, the future of skin wound forensics may involve advancements in techniques that allow for more precise and rapid histological analysis, such as advanced imaging technologies, development of high-resolution imaging methods or molecular imaging techniques too. Study wound healing processes at a cellular or molecular level. Biomarker identification, discovery of specific biomarkers or molecular signatures. In wounds that can aid in determining wound age or other forensic aspects. Integration of multiple disciplines, collaboration between forensic pathology histology, molecular biology, and other disciplines to create a comprehensive approach for analyzing wounds and providing forensic evidence. Advancements in these areas could significantly enhance the accuracy and efficiency of wound analysis in forensic investigations.